The year was 2012 and I was six years old and in primary one. TV was a very big thing in my household as most of our family watched it and when I was that age shows that I watched consisted of Milkshake, Tiny Pop and CBBS. These channels were great when I was growing up because it kept me entertained for hours on end with shows such as Thomas the Tank Engine, In the Night Garden, The Cat in the Hat which is a very underrated show and I don't think anybody has ever watched it apart from me. Teletubbies and that's just to name a few. They were great shows which taught me and my brother tons of life lessons growing up and some of them were just great to watch before bed. I know a lot of people that watched these when they were my age and in my opinion they're so much better than what parents usually set their kids in front of. <coughs> to begin with, I'm going to talk about Milkshake. Now, this was actually not a channel but something that appeared on Channel 5 before all of the adult stuff uh, came on. Um, it would start at round about 7 o'clock and end at around about 9. Uh, I'm not sure if it's still the same now, but it was. Um, and I remember one day getting so excited to come get up and watch uh, Milkshake. Um, I got up at 5 o'clock and sat there, um, but the it hadn't started yet, and Channel 5 is one of those things which just play 24 hours. Um, but um, I ended up watching many episodes of Police uh, Interceptors. I'm sorry, Baldy. You can call me Baldy or like. Don't bother me. I didn't call you Baldy, Baldy. And uh, crime tenants, landlords, and stuff like that. Uh, Milkshake was essentially Disney Junior, but it was for Freeview TVs. Um, and if you don't know what Freeview is, it's basically like uh, when you pay for your TV license, you get selected channels. And we used to have Sky, but for whatever reason, we got rid of it. Uh, so yeah, we had Freeview uh, until I was um, about seven. The first show I'm going to talk about today is the Mr. Men show, and that show was the shit. It was amazing. The show was a retelling of the books, but retold in ways for younger children, and uh, it had a better. Uh, I'm not sure how to say it, but it kept children's attention spans quite well. Uh, by having like, things like Mr. Bump falling over um, every scene he was in and stuff like that. Rather, in the books, um, there would be more of a story to it. But the show is great, and there's episodes of it on YouTube if you want to watch. By the time I was in Primary 3, I had moved on from those shows uh, into uh, more adult things. Well, not adult, but like, f you know, for my age. Uh, that consisted of Cartoon Network and. Nickelodeon stuff like that, but I'm not gonna mention those because we all know how great those are I'm going to be mentioning CBBC. It was basically children's BBC uh, Shows I remember from it go like Arthur. It was great uh, News round which is just BBC news, but a lot more um, you know child friendly But the main thing I remember is kicks and pop. It shouldn't be hard. Most of them don't wear clothes Hey, yo, what the fuck now? Firstly, we're going to talk about Pop. Now, Pop was the channel you'd pick when there was literally nothing on. Most of the time it just had episodes of like, I don't know, Power Rangers and stuff like that. Things that didn't really interest me, but I knew a lot of people liked them. One of the shows I remember on it was called Oggy and the Cockroaches. <laughs> Um, I don't really remember much, but I rem know it's a, a cat and some cockroaches, and the theme song scared the living shit out of me as a child. <sighs> Another show I remember was called Sally Bollywood, which was a show which consisted of um, some girl and her best friend, uh, who, uh, I forget his name, but um, they were, uh, they uh, find it out, they found out things like they were essentially Sherlock Holmes of their high school and I don't remember anything about it except for one episode where um, they found out that um, before going on their school trip somebody had put yogurt in the bus's exhaust. What a great show honestly. Uh, I should probably mention I can't find any proof of that happening. Uh, I was going to include a video or something off it but I, I can't find any footage or picture anything, so you're just gonna have to take my word for it. 
final show I'm going to be talking about in pop was called Transformers Rescue Bots and it was just Transformers but neutered for like preschoolers. Hey guys, editor's note here. Uh, I've just uh, looked through all of this footage I need to still edit and oh my god, it is just terrible. Literally, it's currently nine months old and I'm just not going to sit through and edit this. I ramble on for ages and there's like no jokes. I've had to edit in jokes for most of this video. So yeah, better video coming soon. Thanks.